Here we have a standard non-combo enclosed control unit and the kit required to field install a 10250T pilot light kit. We have the following part numbers, ECN0508AAA, normally closed auxiliary contact number C320KGS2, and kit number C400T9A and C400T10A. Step number one in installing the C400T9A and C400T10A kit is to screw off the nut on the inside of the flange connected to the hole plugs. Discard the two hole plugs. Step 2 is to unscrew the nut, lens, and legend plate from the C400T9A and C400T10A kits. Step 3 is to mount the pilot lights on the box by taking it from the inside and pulling it up through the hole. Place the legend plate on the outside of the flange over the pilot lights, lock down the nut, and screw on the lens. Step 4 consists of mounting the normally closed auxiliary contact on the side of the starter opposite the existing normally open contact. Step 5, begin with the red run pilot light. There are two black and white wires. Connect wire X1 to the A1 terminal on the coil of the starter. Connect the remaining X2 wire to the A2 terminal of the coil. For the green off pilot light, connect wire X1 to terminal 1 on the normally closed auxiliary contact and connect wire X2 to terminal 96 of the overload relay. Control power will still need to be connected to terminal 2 of the normally closed auxiliary contact in order for the green light to work.